Hey, 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 What's Eggman's out of the robot. On? What the fuck is happening? Isn't that a trip? It's, uh... It's Eggbutt. It's, uh... Okay, legit, I used to sit there in, in, in this lobby in the chow garden and just run in a circle like this. I remember for this. fucking just the not, longest not time. Not usually as Eggman. Probably for a straight usually hour. Usually as No, Sonic. every character I've done this with. Eggman, every character, I've ran around this lobby and just gotten a feel for the running speed over and over again. Seen how I've, like, trying I, to get the I feet to skip and shit. That. God, I played this game so fucking much as a kid. Alright, we're going to the it's chow garden. horrible. Um, the reason we're playing as yeah. Eggman... Is that uh, Eggman is the best for gra Oh my god. I'll explain that later oh when I Oh my god. Going. Anyways, I, I did... Don't stop Wait, how are the, the chows, chow? This is the first time I've been here oh and they're already hatched. Anyways, yeah. There's chows. You pick that bitch up. <laughs> Look at how fucking adorable that bitch is. Oh, here's another one. <laughs> you fucking turd. I love You them. little depressed... Oh, it's because oh. it's a... Uh, the chows from the other file I have, I think, are still oh, they're my favorite ever. here. I can nuzzle them. That's my yeah, nuzzling. Yeah, you, you for, do uh, share one chow garden, don't you? Shakey, shake, 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 shake. It's a shaking. That bit. doesn't look comforting. It. That looks like it would be painful. I don't think Eggman gives a shit. <laughs> Quite pet, honestly. Pet him. Pet his head. This one's depressed. Pet looking. his head and say yosh. This one's got a permanent. Pet him and say yosh. Yosh indeed. Yosh. <laughs> Yours. <laughs> hey, Chow. <laughs> he's so why sad. You, Look at his face. Why are you sitting around being got, all depressed and shit? He's got corn on his face. What was the line from the <laughs> other old <laughs> century? What's up, nigga? Why are you so depressed and sad all the time like a little bitch? What's up, Chow? Why are you so depressed and sad all the time? I don't time care like about what bitch. you're going through or what you're gonna do. I need uh, bars, 16 of them. That is most legit. He is over. very quickly now, turning yes. dark. You see, this is how you, you grind your uh <laughs> your your I chow remember it taking longer than this. Well that's what if you if you just feed them capsules, they they slowly change like this. But if you just mash it and just really just right, pet the I fuck remember, out of them. I remember they even mashing it quickly. taking a lot longer. Nah, it's very fast. Like maybe as kids we perceived it as longer because we had short attention spans. But I have, but I have that, done this that too thing many is like immediately times. dark. It is very dark. That is a chocolate motherfucker. Ugh. There's actually a rare, like, chow genetic. I guess you could say. I think it's come from mixed breeding chows and stuff, where instead of turning red on or, or pink on their feet they they turn white on their hands and feet and have a blue hue like coming out of it so they're like more of a blue dark chow than a red dark chow that is like my favorite looking one there i think is, you have to breed it with a, a hero chow to guys, do that seriously it's very deep if anything <laughs> you're seeing on screen right now looks interesting to you which oh my god is so fucking adorable yeah so if, basically you 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 feed the chow's capsules to raise their stats it takes for fucking ever so i'm going to show you if the idea grind. of raising <laughs> and breeding these adorable fucking things in this angelic location with this music that you will remember for the rest of your life oh yeah Burned into the back and of the fucking and skull. And I don't, I don't mean Dude, I, I, remember... used to, I used to play this so much, I would go to bed, and it's all I could hear. Right. I would just lay in bed, and Dude, all I could Victor, hear was this. I still <laughs> sometimes lay in bed, and all oh I hear God. is chow music. We used to when leave I it say, on when we went to school so that it would uh, this progress is a, this the is a different, time, a different like, level from. from what I mean. Like, with the rest of the game, we've been talking about how the music's so memorable, and, like, it's yeah. our childhood. This is a different kind of thing. Oh, yeah. I hear chow music sometimes out of oh. nowhere in my head it just starts oh playing so the, the worst thing about this is to raise a chow's stamina you have to feed them fruit and they only want to eat the fruit when they're hungry otherwise they'll just fucking toss it and it's the most frustrating thing in the world to find them when they're hungry and fucking force them to eat this fruit I will just sit here and hand it to them over and over again and shove it down their goddamn throat. Isn't there like throat. a bunch of different kinds of fruit? It raises like, really slowly. Yeah, there are different fruits that they'll like more. Fruits. They have different like Dude, this preferences. is so fucking deep. Like the more oh, I think about it, well, I'm like, go, Let's go to the God. daycare. Yeah, the daycare I'll, is where we can really see. I, I can really explain a lot of this shit because I, I spent a lot of time studying chows. And like, I didn't, 
Back when I was, it's like a, was it's like young. a legit fucking like yeah, like something really you would do on an exposition, like a fucking but like a goddamn Australian like the thing is I don't know outback. everything about Charles oh because God, a bunch of doors. when I was a kid I I didn't know how to use the internet and I never used the internet so this is everything I know about Charles is just from playing the game like literally just from playing the game and we had the strategy guide which told you a little bit but everything I know is just from playing the game so fucking long and experimenting with these Charles. That I have found so much stuff. Quincy. Quincy. I don't wanna. Not, oh, did I give him the name Quincy? I wish Quincy a happy life. Oh, fuck, I named him Quincy! Alright, this is Quincy Jones the Chow. <laughs> hey, man. Anyway, that's the fortune teller. You go Quincy. there, they, they either give you an auto name or you can name it yourself. Uh, I think I wanna name it myself. Fuck this. I don't wanna name him Quincy. But Quincy's fine. Yeah, but we can give him a fun name. <laughs> oh, how about this? Spike, no. You See, if you say the no, then, you, then they, it tries again. Can you tell what I'm doing? I don't <laughs> I want can't tell if I'm... Chowro. Name the chow yourself. There we go. Oh, God, that's a lot of letters. What do we name the chow? Let's name it Asterisks. <laughs> No. Let's, let's hey, give oh, it a super... Japanese character. Let's give it a super weeby Japanese let me, let me name. name I like how it's Katakana, it. too. No, I want to name it. It's my chow. Name him Supa. I was going to do that. <laughs> the dash to make it sue <laughs> Wait. Actually, how did you know I was gonna okay. name it super let's name it superfly kid is there space for that uh super where did sue go? Su we need the dash I, I guess that dash will do that dash does yeah su Supa. Wait, how do you get a pa where, where, oh, okay they've got, they've got the little uh those pa Oh, cool! It just attaches. Supa, fudai. That. Fu. Wait, wait, wait. Let me find it. Fu. <laughs> la la la. la. E. Yeah. Supa fudai. Supa fudai. I have this this hilarious thing. I'm in this Japanese Supa class. Fry. I think I actually already explained this in the video. It's a super uh, fry. Where, where you ask a Japanese teacher like. What is, how do you say, someone's, someone today said, how do you say French toast? And she said, French toast. <laughs> right. <laughs> and then just laughed. <laughs> I think we discussed that in, uh, Yeah, I think, I think we in, did discuss it in But I think episode. it was in, um. The Smash Bros. one? Yeah, the Smash Bros. one, okay. which I have not released yet. Okay, so this is actually a way to, to study this your, doctor, your chow's different stats. This fucking doctor. So you do, see the doctor, he analyzes your chow. Then the, you go to the wait, medical wait, chart. Let me let, wait, wait, wait. Let me uh, read the doctor's dialogue next time it's on screen. Okay, so this is where the breeding comes in. But your child has these base stats, and then you basically you breed it with other childs who have high stats. In the it's like a lot like breeding Pokemon, but you basically try to get s stats. Childs with high stats Victor, and certain things to breed with other with an other indoor child's. Voice. Not then, only are you clipping, I'm very excited about it. You're not, I got really close to the mic and everything. You're not only but, clipping the audio; you're giving me a headache. Okay. Talk like a person. So anyways, that's how you breed chows. You, you mix them together, you get higher stats. So I think S is like the best. A Tails Chow, which you can get from Fantasy Star Online or something, is like straight A's. Tells you what uh, their personality is, what kind of food they like, their age. Wait, Times wait, Transformed is actually on. Uh, let me read the condition in the doctor's voice. <laughs> your your chow is very healthy. Oh please, God, please he's Rick. Please, please oh take God, care the of your chow. Oh God, the chow doctor is Rick. <laughs> <laughs> uh, I don't, I don't know. <laughs> I, don't, I don't feel like I'm healthy. I like I like foods that are shaped in squares. You, 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 not, your chow, your chow's gonna be. About, your, I don't know what you're talking about, doctor. What are you, you, what are you doing? What are you chow, doing with that? Your that, chow's healthy. That that uh, heart, that heart monitor thing. You're. You're Lots putting of fruit in the and air. seeds. I, I don't think you're supposed to drink that much when you're in the doctor's office. Yes. Victor, can we talk one at a time? Why are we doing this? <laughs> Rick and Morty don't talk one at a time. What are you talking about? Yes, they about? do. Your child's out there. Okay. <laughs> God. That's so fun of it. Let me talk over. But yeah, this tells you all your child's stats. Transformed is like your child's actually die Here's or they health. or they become Surgeon reincarnated. Get... It's it's <clears throat> fucking madness. You can put them in the classroom, they'll learn how to do stupid shit, like, draw. Dude, go in there, you gotta listen to the music. Oh god, the, the chow music. singing. It's like the best part of the whole Eggman, game. Eggman, you fuckboy, show me the- Ah, oh, I shouldn't name my chow fuckboy. Look at this asshole. Look at this- this bored fuck dancing <laughs> in the, the corner. Look at the one with the shark teeth! <laughs> he's just- 
Oh He's my really god, going for I it. love them so much. Oh my god. They're too fucking adorable. This one's like drawing on the floor. Dude. They all look bored as shit. Every, they're fucking stupid. They're learning anyway. maracas. They're learning <laughs> they are learning maracas. maracas. If oh, you leave your chairs there. Is a, the black market. <laughs> literally called the black market. You go in here and there's like a fucking fish oh man in a chow with a medical mask on. Oh no, why is it the black yeah, market? Yeah, the fucking black market. But this is where you buy seeds to plant trees. He's in the locker. He's. You buy shit to put on chow's heads. Oh my I can get a square God. seed, plant a square tree. My chow likes square fruit, so he'll like that. Oh my God. Um, that's fucking amazing. You get, you get different fruits. See, this is how you get your child to actually eat the fucking fruit to the raise your stamina. The water the trees, But then this right? shit is expensive, so I hate do you, this. Do you have to get them a watering can? Fuck, I think so. I think they have to plant them, too. I don't remember. Yeah, I do think so. They it's have complicated. Because I know they have a little There's shovel. A bunch of they get an adorable little shovel. Anything you teach them in school, they will they will then do. Like if they learn maracas, they'll they'll sometimes just sit around and they'll pull out maracas uh -huh. and start playing it. So if all your chows know different stuff, they can all do different stuff. You yeah. teach them all so kinds of different abilities. Fruit. Uh, you can plant different kinds of fruit, get different kinds of eggs, and you get different kinds of chow out of those uh -huh. eggs. And then if you you can breed chows once they're a certain age. Because they'll go through cocoons and they'll metamorphose. Yeah, I was going to talk about breeding into the, the cocoon shit in a minute. But, um, I think what you have to do is actually, like, teach them how to dig. And then they'll just, like, dig a hole and plant the shit themselves on their right. own accord. I believe they Something do that. stupid like that. Anyway, so what we're going to do now, I'm going to show you how to grind power crystals. Because they all have these different stats. And depending on their highest stat, like, if you have a stat that's, like, greatly higher than all the other ones, that will change their appearance when they evolve. So, I think my favorite looking chow is the... There's actually a, the knight's chow is the dark flying. That's one of my favorites, but I like the dark swimming. So, we're gonna go fucking grind swimming shit. And so... We're not really gonna, like, get um, in super deep on this, are we? We can. Like, I don't want this video to be <laughs> two hours We can long. skip into it. I just... You know, I want to show. I, I don't want to watch you play like chows for two hours. I like the chow. Anyways, this is how I usually grind shit. Right, you Basically, go to you go in here... And within the first two rooms, you get enough crystals to fill your whole bar, which you can either right. do by getting all the crystals you pick up if you're just trying to grind everything, or you just repeat the level in, until you get all the crystals right. that you want. Like, there's there's enough... Each different color uh, corresponds to a different type of thing. Yeah. So there's enough crystals in just these first three rooms to fill up your whole... Uh, like, that, like, once your bar is yeah. full, it starts replacing them. And so... What you can do is... Just restart it super fast. And right, you, you restart the stage and it keeps the amount of crystals you have. So then, if you just want one specific color, uh -huh. you just keep replaying the first few seconds of the stage over and over again, just collecting that one color. Yeah. It's so like Victor's trying to. Looks like he's trying to get green. Well, I was just showing that how right. fast it was to restart it. I was gonna go go for anything specific. But basically, green is running. <laughs> Purple's flying, yellow's swimming, red is power. Oh, and each character has to unlock Chow World individually yeah. by getting the key to Chow World from the Chow Box in one of their stages, yeah. and then beating that stage. So as you see, all the power crystals fly out of them. Uh, and part of the replay value of this game is, um, if you want to get a Chaos Chow, you have to feed them every different type of animal in the game, which we had the animals in all those stages. I never showed what they were for. But the animals are for feeding your chows, and they'll right, raise they different Right, they become stats. like they become chimeras when you give yeah, them. Yes, they become chimeras, if, and it's disturbing. If a chow, you fucking dipshit, you don't steal that other fucker's. Get get the fuck out of here. Put that fucker in the water so he doesn't steal the other guy's crystals. Get him out of the water so you can fucking feed him. Um. Yeah. If you if a chow plays with one of the little animals you pick up in the stage, and it transforms their body, and they gain some of that animal's parts. Yeah. It, it also raises their stats, but the animals will also we lower have, uh, some stats, too. We have both never been a fan of the way Chows look with they the animals. They look stupid as shit most of the time. Right. Except for the ones with the unibrows, because that's fucking hilarious. <laughs> oh, yeah, the unibrow but, when you yeah. give them a monkey. That's hilarious. They look insane. Sometimes I might give them, like, all dragons, so they'll have all the dragon parts. Oh, yeah. And that, that's cool. Oh my god, they're so fucking... There's they, so much. They're like, the sheer variety of, like, chow emotions and sounds yes. and, like, they different things they do. They spend a lot of time on do. chows. Like, if you teach... If they learn singing, they'll sing oh. all kinds of different songs and shit. And, uh, they'll play... And they'll play together sometimes. Uh -huh. If you... If two of them know different kinds of instruments, they'll get together and, like, perform as a group yes. and shit. Here's how you murder your chows. 
Oh, you're not gonna kill him, are you? Nah, that's the departure machine. So if you're sick of your chow, and because there's like a, a limit of like eight chows per garden, right? You can say goodbye to it, which is the most depressing thing in the world. Your chow will have a Look happy life in a faraway forest. You will never uh, see your chow again. That's fucking sad. Look, he's got the, uh, the thing. Yeah. Okay, make it go just depresses away. I don't want to see this. At it. Um, <laughs> how do you get the other two? Oh, it's when you get a. When you evolve a chow into a dark or light chow, you unlock the other two gardens. Yeah, There's a dark garden and a light garden. The dark garden literally looks like hell. Uh, and the light garden is somewhat more heavenly version of this garden, essentially. Um, are you going to take a, a chow to the competitions, to the games, and show us well, the Well, we game? don't have any stats, so it's not going to... Yeah, but at least show us what it is. All right. So if you run into the waterfall... There's a chow race and chow karate... Which Chow Karate is only in battle. I'm not battle. sure if even let me do either of these. It's only in battle? What? Yes, it's only in Sonic Adventure Holy 2 battle. Holy shit. And I learned that because the there, Chow is, is great. there is actually a $3 DLC on Steam of everything you get from battle. Wow. It's called the Battle DLC. Battle was a much better game. Anyways, so right now all we have is a beginner race. Right. Basically, Which basically we're probably going to lose because you, you don't have all a lot of stats. All the races. Well, this guy has one and everything. Maybe he can do something. But the more you beat the races, there's three levels of each race, and then you unlock new races. There's a shit ton of races. Are there that many? There are a lot. All right. And then, like, the races, it's, it's this, awesome. I this is this the most <laughs> hands-off approach to game, like, imaginable. Oh it's basically you just raise your stats so it's Look better than the other chows, them. and then you just you just watch them race. And you, you cheer them. them on to, like, give them a temporary speed boost, and that's it. This... Uh. Chow Garden is a better game it is, in it's every awesome. way. It's so deep. <laughs> Honestly, yeah. but if you see them. Um, they're if, different head types. That's this is because we did a, a foot race, and so these are all chows that are that are geared towards running. I think so I can say begun to change. Um, if Look, this, they can all walk, fuck asses. If this game looks like uh, er, the Chow Garden, if this looks like your kind of thing. Um, and you've never played this game before, and you don't own it in uh -huh. any capacity, and this really seems like your kind of thing. Get this game. Ten dollars is worth the price. <laughs> Definitely. I'm just saying. You can you, play this forever. You can get a lot of time out of this. I mean, there's gonna be a lot of grinding. Don't get me wrong. Chow raising is mostly a period of. Oh, I you won. won just Fuck from stamina. Yeah. So what he was doing uh, was uh, the stamina bar. If Victor presses A, his chow goes faster because you're cheering him on. But he has a limited amount of stamina. And if he runs out, he starts going real slow. Mm -hmm. So managing the stamina is the only real engagement you have here. And there's also chow karate, but um, only in battle, which is very similar. Um, also, if you, you win a number of like better races, you'll get like medals for your chow. You'll get like toys right. for your chow. This shit what is. The fuck, this is a different fruit than before. I am confused. This shit is exponentially more in depth than even the most in depth browser game about raising dumb animals. Probably. Super fruit. And there's a backdrop of decently fun levels for you to go get their shit. <laughs> oh, you can uh, give him the egg and he'll put it on his head and live it with a shell on, like, on his head. They have to be smart enough to do it. Oh, do they? There's all kinds of shit you can give them, right? Like for them to put on. You retard. Stuff like put this that. on your head, you jackass. Give it to the other one. Give it to the <laughs> black one. Look at him. You mean yeah, once super these, uh, fly? Once their stats get high enough, then they'll be able to walk. They won't uh, have trouble swimming. Eventually, if they're like, oh, yeah. if the swim stat is super high, they'll start doing backstrokes and shit. They'll do all kinds of shit. Um, if they're, oh my, take the fucking egg. If they're climbing and there flying get high enough, then they'll climb up the cliffs and fly yeah, down just at random. Later. Um, oh yeah, they'll fly around. If you jump on them, they bounce all over the place like a ricochet bullet. But they don't like that. Do it anyway. Jump also, if you water. mistreat your child, they'll eventually die. Oh they yeah. They will just die. Um, but just what? Oh, maybe you can... I can't do it in this game? What the hell? Maybe, maybe they introduced that in battle. battle. <laughs> that would be weird. You can throw them at the wall. <laughs> Boom, bitch! Oh no, go I pet him. Go make him feel better. I hope he cries. They will cry and it's depressing. <laughs> it's really sad. There's look, actually, at, look at him crying. Oh god. There's actually two different there kinds of chow crying. Um, when they're crying evil. for real, then they, they like go like sniff, sniff. But when they're being a brat, they do, oh, yeah, like, they do like, like the, the big the, cry. The bratty cry. And if they're doing that, then it just means your chow is going through a bratty phase. Yeah, the doctor will tell you your chow is a brat. Yeah. <laughs> 
so much shit. Yeah. Like we're it's so weird. I, why did they never make a second game? I think oh, we're oh, like, Garden. I think like, we're I honestly, really don't get it. Like we've said a lot, but we're kind of scratching the surface. Yeah. When you get into breeding, it gets so complex. Once you see it all, and then like, and there's different like, because you also unlock different kinds of eggs yeah. from the store. Like depending on what you have in your garden, you'll unlock different uh, like. Um, shiny eggs and shit like yeah, uh, like amethyst or topaz and the shit. The funnest like thing that. for me was always the concentrated stats and like getting their heads to look different. That was always my oh my yeah. Goal the shape of their fun. head uh, depends on like yeah their highest stat when they evolve. Yeah. Which that was my thing. And there's like the knight's chow, which is the flying one. It has like these stems that come out and then go down. And then I found out with my most powerful chow, like eventually they turn up into like devil horns. I don't know what made that happen. I've the been trying to figure it out chows, for so long. By the way, I believe the way you get a chaos chow is that they have to go through two. Um, because chows, first of all, they evolve. Mm. Um, they they evolve by like after you've taken care of them a certain amount, they turn into either a dark or a light chow, or a, or a neutral chow. Yeah. But then they go through a second evolution later in life when they've just gotten really old. Uh -huh. And one of two things will happen. They're either reborn as a baby chow again, or, like, they're, like they're literally reincarnated. And all their or, stats are gone. Right, all their stats are gone, <laughs> but they still have, like, the same but appearance and everything. They're, they're also, their, their, like, their base stats will be better. Right. So they, they'll keep getting, like, able to be more powerful. Yeah. But, um, but if you, if you don't take good enough care of them... Then when they go into their second evolution, they go into a gray cocoon and then they just die. Yeah. So they will just die but you if you don't take prevent. any care. Of them. If they start going to that gray cocoon, there's nothing you can do. Yeah, we I remember used to just, we like, tried try to, to restart save the them. game and like try to save it. You can't do it. Every time you walk into the garden, they'll fucking die. Ugh. But um, it, to get a chaos chow, they have to be reincarnated twice, and then before they evolve, yeah. you have to give them every animal in the game in between them. In between them being reincarnated the second time and evolving, which sometimes they evolve really quick, so you yeah. gotta be careful about that. And if you can manage to give them every animal in the game before then, uh, the then they will become forever. a Chaos Chow, which is like this really intense looking version. Mm -hmm. And they have to have been, like, if you want the dark one, they have to have been dark through both stages of their life leading up to that. I don't think so. That <laughs> something like nah, that. That's not a thing. But, uh, yeah, and another thing is that, like, the older they get, the more likely they are to, like, do the death thing, but then there's no guarantee what age they're gonna do that at. I've had Chows who've been, like, nine years old in the, uh, from what the doctor says, and they still didn't fucking do that, and it's just really miserable. And they also get bigger as they get older, too. Which is weird. There's a lot of stuff. I don't know how long this episode is or how it's gonna be. Uh, we can <laughs> stop whatever you want. We've we, probably yeah, gone for we, over Yeah, we've talked minutes. about Chows. I don't want to end up, like, fucking falling off the wagon and, and getting back into this right. we'll have time for because that's the thing it. like as you can like, see yeah. we've been talking I can get really really into well, this well it's not <laughs> just that we've been talking about this for 20 minutes and you've been doing stuff and not a lot has been done yeah well I haven't been speed getting the uh right but my things. point is that this gives you a perspective on how much time yeah, it takes all the stats raised to 99 right which I have done before he's gotten them all <laughs> level 1 right now so, yeah. like, the amount of replaying of that me of that fucking Eggman level uh -huh. that you would have to do... I would say, at most, you can get <laughs> one and a half level out of collecting just one type of crystal from running it. So, so you have to run it a lot of times. You have to run it, like, <laughs> fucking 60 times with... To raise one stat up all the way. Right, to raise one stat. So, yeah, lots and lots of grinding, if that's what you're going for. But uh, if you get heavy into chow breeding, it is a complex world. Yeah, you have to get them to, to make love. And this music they'll, loops they'll make forever, eggs. and it can be completely There's actually a love fruit. You can give them the love fruit. Um, oh, God. But it is very peaceful and serene and Leave relaxing. your ridiculous chow stories in the comments. Yes, if you have awesome I'm sure chow you're, stories. I'm sure you've already typed that comment anyways. Yes. <laughs> I'm sure you're you're ready to fucking tell me how this shit works before I finish my <laughs> sentence. There's like, no I'm going to learn so there much There is no comments. way that there's that much to learn that we don't know already. I don't know. That you there's, don't There's know so much words like I don't know specifically how it works, but I know it works. I don't remember how to get the Tails Chow. I know we had one at the some The Tails Chow is some GBA trading bullshit. Because uh, um, on the GameCube version, this is a GBA instead right. of a uh, Chow thing. 
Oh yeah. And then there was a Sonic yeah. Advance game you could trade your Chows in between. Which I did a couple times. Alright, well, that's it. Yay. That's our last video on Sonic Adventure 2 this for now. It. We might revisit this game in this the future to do challenge modes. But, uh, yeah, that's it. It's a, a, a very mediocre, if not poor game with a very interesting and super in-depth grind fest of a Chow game yes. attached to it. Uh, and it, it's got a... It's got good vision, in my opinion. It's got good ambition. I feel like there was hard. Is this how we're ending this? With I feel you like walking yeah. into this wall. Yeah, yeah, yeah. yeah. <laughs> <laughs> I feel like there was some soul in this game. I feel like the developers really you like did that, try, uh, you and like that's the... why I respect it more than any of the other Sonic games. Do you like that's the my ocean texture statement. there in the background? I I it's love just it. It's a solid it doesn't fucking move. texture. Dude, of there's ocean. so many. <laughs> I spent so long trying to escape this place as like tails. Because you could fly oh, around. Yeah. And I would just sit there and jump at every wall and like try to find the glitches and like shit like that. All right, can't let's you not get let's not get high up that. in this. Not like, as Eggman. Eggman. Can't, I mean, as Tails, can't, can't you get pretty high up? Yes. <laughs> <laughs> All right, everybody. Yes. Join us in the. What's the next game we're gonna play? Uh, either Sonic Generations or. No, 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 not Sonic. The sixty-four game. Not, what's Kirby? the next? Okay, yeah. Kirby so, sixty-four. Kirby and the Crystal Shards. All right. Uh, it might be that. Brian on Shards or Pokemon Snap. Or it might Crystal be Shards that. or Pokemon Snap. Depending on We're if probably I can gonna be playing them it to run. By, by the time that you see this, so you'll, you'll already know what the next game we play is. Um, <laughs> I think we. It, unless we can. Whatever. Unless I'll we let this out. all run out. Alright, bye bye! Yeah!